Well, we have our prayers now for the um, the church universal, the church particular, and uh, at this time we need to lift up any prayers that we may have. I I noticed here that we have at least three people that we need to lift up for travel mercies. The Lormers are on their way to Tennessee. Sun Young and her family are on their way to Chicago and the likes as we speak. I'll get to you, honey. That honey is my wife. And the likes are on their way to Michigan and Lake Michigan, where unfortunately they have to go salmon fishing and trout fishing. And uh, um, Heron flies back on Tuesday, so to Korea, so we need to lift Heidi up. And so those are travel mercies. Are there any other travel mercies before I get going? Yes. Ruben and a friend of his are going to Chicago for a game day. Oh, to see the Cubs lose? It is G, so. Oh. <laughs> Can go see? travel mercy. Oh, travel mercy. <laughs> but we're not praying for the Cubs anymore, are we? Oh, yeah. Why? That's a wasted prayer. <laughs> um, uh, Swale. Fatty, okay, travel mercies, all right. Sammy from Spain and Fatty from... Uh, Lebanon, right? Okay. Yes. Todd Thompson, uh, for healing for his knee, he's playing football with some teenagers and all the tendons that held his uh, thigh muscle to his knee cap. Oh. Uh, yes, Bob. Uh, my friend, Mike, uh, Mike at Stonebelt, he broke his foot. Oh, no. Okay, well, pray for Mike at Stonebelt. All right, Bud? Who sent his mother still in the hospital and will be operating on in the morning. All right. And then we have a baby that's going to be born in October, I think, don't we? <laughs> oh, we'll pray for your baby, all right, Judy? All right. And you're going to name that baby David, right? Sure. Thanks, see? So they're going to change your mind from Grace into David, and I think that's why so you did it, yes. All right. Uh, any other? Yes? Uh, for all of my grandparents, I'm lucky enough to have them all with me, but they're all in various states. Of okay. Needing prayer. Brenda. <laughs> Thank you. Travel mercies for Angel. Oh, all right. Angel has to fly out in just a few moments for um, Baltimore. That's Brenda's daughter. It's my daughter, too. <laughs> Any students need prayer? <laughs> all right. Let's turn our attention to prayer. <laughs> Gracious and heavenly God, first we thank you for this most splendid of days. We rejoice with the humidity and the hot weather. We're grateful for the way you have arranged this uh, planet of ours. And now is the time for growing. And we give thee thanks for this. We give thee thanks for the hot weather, the humidity, and the rain. For that, um, um, that enables all the plant life to grow and to, and to grow abundantly. And that means more people can be fed and more people can be healed and more people can grow and, and have healthy bodies. And so we rejoice and we're always glad, whatever the circumstance. We've come before you, O oh, Heavenly Father, um, with many, many concerns, all, all good. And, and even before a, a, a prayer is uttered from my lips, why you know everything all together. Nonetheless, it is for the discipline of being about the purpose of prayer that we lift up uh, for travel mercies, the Lormers, and Sun Young, and her family, and Heilong, we lift her up as well, and Sammy, and Fatty, and Reuben, and Angel. We would ask that each of those people that you would 
be around them and, and that their, their journeys today um, would be enjoyable and uh, rest-filled and, and without anxiety. <clears throat> protect them as they travel. Um, we ask that you be with those in need of healing, too. We ask that you be with Lucinda's mother. And with, with you, with Robert's friend Mike at Stonebelt. And with Todd Thompson, and that you would heal his knee and, and return him to <coughs> a measure of good health. And for the Steubenrock grandparents, that you would be with them in this interesting time in their lives. And that you would be with your servant and your friend Evelyn Foster, and that you would guide her through her um, surgery this Tuesday and restore her to good health. We ask that you continue to be with Lou Tompkins, and we ask that um, you receive our thanksgivings for your healings uh, with Hilda Dyer. We give thee thanks for the gift of Chelsea Parker. And thank you for bringing uh, Sarah Woodley and Hugh and um, Bob and his friend back to us today. And we rejoice in that spiritual connection that though it was 15 years ago, it seems like today. And we thank you for that gift. And, and we ask blessings upon them as well. Gracious and heavenly God, we ask that you be with our friends abroad that you be with our friends in harm's way, particularly those in um, Colombia and, and those in the Middle East. That you would guide them in ways of forgiveness and righteousness. Gracious and heavenly God, um, we ask that you receive this prayer knowing it is incomplete and far from perfect. But we ask that you receive this completely perfect prayer. Our Father, who art in heaven, Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done. On earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our debts. As we forgive our debtors. And it is not into temptation. But deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom. And the power. And the glory forever. Amen. Thank you so much. And I would say to you then. May the peace and love of Jesus be with you. And please share the peace of Christ with your neighbor.